So um, we are really low on food. That's it. It's pretty, it's pretty grim on Catalpa. Wow. There is no supermarkets out here, so when food runs low, you got to go hunt something. Taj makes sure we don't starve this week. We also have some bad weather, but get some sunshine and fun waves too. Welcome to our life on the sea. We are an Australian family that fell in love with the ocean and living on a boat travelling. I'm Sarah and together with Lee and our two kids, Taj and Bella, we are documenting our travels as we sail the world one island at a time. This lifestyle is fun, adventurous, humbling and incredibly challenging, but we wouldn't have it any other way. We hope these little videos make you smile and inspire you to chase your dreams. Subscribe to our channel to join us and our travels as we share our life on the sea. This is what breakfast looks like when you run out of eggs, when you run out of a lot of things. <laughs> We've got bread, baked beans, some uh, cashew cheese, or if you don't like cashew cheese, we've got some homemade peanut butter. That's it, it's pretty, it's pretty grim on Catalpa. Ah, uh, baked beans in a small, small space, not good. and then we're going to start heading south. The weather has been no good to head south. It's been really stormy and crazy, so. We're still here. Still here. We're running out of food, so we do know where there's a good little spearing ground. And um, we might have to get some fish before we get out to our other island. But tell me, do you want to carry on? Taj made sure the family didn't starve, bringing in a nice job fish. Oh, without water, and they cave when it's cold. We could go till we're older. Put your head on my shoulder and let's enjoy. Giant Valley. And they came when it's cold. We could go till we're older. Put your head on my shoulder. And let's enjoy the ride. Uh -huh. Let's just this is what happens when vegetables and fruit run low on the boat. You make green pancakes because you feel guilty and you're trying to get nutrients into your kids. Mmm, <laughs> they look delicious. So um, we are really low on food. We've got uh, no veggies left, only frozen peas. And and we've got no fruit, so we can't have our smoothies, which we usually have for breakfast. We've got muesli, but we're getting a bit older that. <laughs> we're getting over the bread too. We have a loaf of bread a day. But, so this morning I made green pancakes. <laughs> Just out of pure guilt, I put everything healthy in there that I could find. We're out of eggs as well. So what I used this morning was flaxseed eggs. Um, they're not eggs. 
they call flaxseed eggs. So they're made of flax seeds and water and you just soak them and they go like the same consistency. And yeah, we made some coconut cream with cinnamon and nutmeg and honey. So see what the family thinks of that. They're all just waking up. I didn't know what they were. <laughs> they're green. They're my favorite color. <coughs> Put some psyllium husk in there too, keep us regular. <laughs> they were delicious. They'll actually like my green pancakes. The other two haven't eaten them yet. Looks can be deceiving, darling. These are beautiful. Are they really? They taste healthy. They're definitely different to a normal pancake. Mate, you go to the toilet. I thought that. <laughs> We got out to Treasure Island to find some pretty nice conditions. This surf break needs the right wind and swell direction to get waves. So we were pretty stoked. And the best bit? There's no one out.
road around. It's a bit chilly. <laughs> it's a bit cold today, so I put a wetsuit on. <laughs> I just put my wetsuit on and I was like, oh, it feels a bit weird. <laughs> so I'm back to the front. <laughs> I've never worn it before. I was like, why do I can't <laughs> <laughs> now they're gonna wait for me to put my wetsuit on the right way. <laughs> We're going spear fishing, but I'm just looking out over here. It's just starting to like barrel. It's like four to five foot out there, and the wind's just turning. So I'm just gonna grab a quick coral trout and then um, go for surf. Oh, well, that feels better. <laughs> it's on the right way. Ready now? The boys had no luck with fish, so it looks like it's rice again for dinner. Lee and I just got back in from a fun little surf. There's actually some fun waves out there, but um, we came in because <laughs> some blackness is uh, engulfing us. We think it's about to get a little bit wild in here. just have a lot of rain in it. Yeah. We don't really know what to look for. Kev does. Well, Kev would be tell us that that was something or it wasn't. The blacker they are, generally the more wind they are. That's pretty black. Oh. Obviously the rain affects the... They were dry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm wet in one second. <laughs> so we just had the anchor alarm go off. Just, just outside. Just outside. We, we haven't drifted far, but we have heaps of chain out, so it's probably why. But we're all good. The fence is settling down a little bit. Wind's dropped off, but it's still raining. The next morning we woke to sunshine and fun waves. We do this every day and I'm still so amazed by you. So hold me tight through the night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just as to
being more than friends. Yeah. You know I'm here to stay every single day. Don't care about the place we found. We'll still be up, still be up. We're in. 